with the 12th pick in the 2006 NBA draft, the New Orleans Oklahoma City Hornets select Hilton Armstrong from the University of Connecticut. The senior center in Connecticut. A couple of picks after Rudy Gay goes to Houston, but then he gets redirected to Memphis. Hilton Armstrong, fourth center taken so far in the first 12 picks. Marcus Williams also expected to be a first-round draft pick for the Connecticut Huskies. The Big East Defensive Player of the Year. Went to the same high school as Elton Brand in Peekskill, New York. Last four-year player from Connecticut drafted in the first round, Travis Knight, 29th overall back in 1996. Amazing progress as a player, Dan. Three years ago, I don't think people would have dreamed that Hilton Armstrong would go in the top dozen picks in the NBA draft. He's got an NBA body. He is a rebounder, shot blocker, blocked over three shots per game. He's got very good feet. He can really run the floor. Offensively, he's still learning. I, I think he's a player that's still coming on. But boy, he is big and strong. He can get off of the floor. He goes after rebounds bounce especially on the offensive end does a good job he can hit from about 18 feet but he's still learning how to play with feel on the offensive end but I'll tell you what big body and he can defend I think he's going to help New Orleans with his defensive mindedness and his ability to rebound he's going to be able to set some screens with that big body and Greg you being a former point guard you know what Chris Paul's impact was on this team are they a playoff team in your opinion I, I tell you what this guy as a center may have the biggest impact of anybody that's been drafted at that position does far because first and foremost he already has the ability defensively to impact the game and he's going to play with a great guard and Chris Paul who's going to get him opportunities on the interior to get easy baskets. When you get easy baskets as a big man it makes the game so much easier for you. Your confidence level rises. You are able to impact the game more. Plus he's going to learn from P.J. Uh, Brown who is a similar player. He reminds me a lot of Elton Campbell. Plays a very similar game to Elton Campbell who had a long career. I like this pick. They were a decent defensive team anyway to begin with and when you got P.J. Brown there to school him and teach him on the fundamentals of the game on a professional level. I just like it. I think it's a good pick by New Orleans. Second Connecticut player selected, and uh, he's sitting by with Stuart Scott. Stuart? The first time that Hilton Armstrong ever saw his college coach, Jim Calhoun, he didn't know who he was. <laughs> How did that meeting go? Um, it was pretty funny. What happened? Uh, I was a little... Just they really didn't know he was. I didn't know about basketball too much at the time. It was college basketball, but my friends don't know who he was, and they thought I was a fool for not knowing. <laughs> <laughs> Your freshman year at UConn, you used to hang around Emeka Okafor. You followed him around like a puppy dog. What's the best advice that the All-American gave you at that time, a young freshman? Um, just be patient and stick with it. Um, good things come when putting a lot of hard work and put time on it. All right, congratulations, Hilton. Dan, talk about blossoming. He blocked more shots his first 15 games this last season than he had his previous three seasons combined. 